Guys, I'm trying to get an afro. Look at that. Stabilized. Bro, Stabby. The, the quality of the, Let me zoom in on that chicken. Oh my god, don't do it. Do, oh my, you're such a nasty. <laughs> you're such a nasty guy. Ooh. Oh my god, oh. Jesus. Let's just eat our Thai food. Yeah, and then we're going to get the mattress later. I'm gonna do the fucking mock bang. Look at that. I like this car. I'm gonna do my Aikido <laughs> to create a vortex. Oh, African hair is the worst to have. Jesus, look at that. I just have to try to comb it out. Okay, I think that's good enough. So go through your outfit, my guy. Okay, check this out. I got this from my brother Jesus. out in Cyprus. You know, the pants. And then this one is, of course, August Aikenbash. So uh, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go out and have some Chinese food. Is it Chinese or I mean, it's Viet Vietnamese food or is it it's just Japanese or is it it's <laughs> Asian food? Asian, yeah. persuasion. Now I do what I want. Now I did, she came over, she got creamed. Okay. Look at the view, my guy. You guys have to see the view. This view? Look at that. It's so beautiful. Oh, freaking okay, guys. penthouse. Let's go. Okay. Ten cent. Ten cent. Hey, do you hear about Ten Cent? One of China's biggest social media platforms. It's a big company which owns rights to a lot of games they came out apparently being racist damn they did not want any blacks in their movies <laughs> that's crazy black people man we're under we're under siege we got the elevator now i do what i want now i do what i want Look at this. Bro, i bought these today for work. Bro, am, is my afro going to be good? You think? Yes, it looks good already, bro. Bro, I'm so hungry. I've been cooking the whole day. I'm so hungry. I need something to eat. Yeah. What's your favorite food? What kind of food do you like? I would say Asian food. Asian? If I'm being honest. What kind of... What's What type of girl do you like? What kind of girl would you say is like your favorite? Uh... Like a blonde, blonde, yeah, Swedish or like uh, Puerto Rican or <laughs> what uh, do you pick? Probably Swedish. Swedish, yeah. Favorite, yeah. Bro, to be honest, I like Mexican girls. You like the Mexicanos? Yeah, they smell like like Mexican beans. food. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about fucking beans, bro. Mexicans don't eat them. Oh yeah, maybe they eat beans. Yeah. No, bro. They eat um. They eat like tacos, right? <laughs> yeah, they, I guess. They smell like tacos. Oh. Now, now I do what I want. Now I do what I want. Jesus. Uh, how long have you had your driving license, my guy? Like three years. I hate shifting the gears. Ah, uh, yeah, it sucks. Trash. It feels good to be oh. in Sweden. That's a wide. It, it feels good sometimes. So what do you hate about this time? Why why you why, nah. why is there so much hate here? I don't know, it's is just it because uh, there's a bunch of losers all living in one town. Yeah, I think th that might be it. Okay. <laughs> he wasn't even <laughs> he wasn't even <laughs> saying anything, bro. I was like, yeah, thanks. <laughs> no, to nobody. Yeah. Open the car. Innan we go to madrasen, eller? Oh are we, yeah, are yeah. We, are we, we going to do the mukbang before we the cockbang? Let's just eat our Thai food. Yeah, and then we're going to get the madras later. I'm going to do the fucking mukbang. Look at that. I like this car. I'm going to do my Aikido <laughs> to, to create a vortex. <laughs> Free Andrew and Tristan, man. I like those guys. So honestly, man, I don't know why people are so sensitive nowadays. 
It's the rapper Gunna. <laughs> it's Gunna. It's Gunna. I think Gunna was involved in a case and he's also snitching, bruh. Serious? Yeah, he snitched on Young Thug. Mm -hmm. Jesus, bruh. These guys, all of them are snitches, bruh. Uh, bruh, if you're facing 20 years, oh my God, I, I'm being honest, man. <laughs> 20 years, if, if these are not my brothers, I'm snitching my Hey, G. go left, go left. Left. Okay. Jesus, you gotta, you're jeopardizing the traffic you community. Know, bro, you gotta do, you gotta be aggressive sometimes, my guy. Why is there so many Volvos in Sweden? Bro, Volvo is the best car. I made a, what, a video about this? Volvo? I made Volvo? a video about the Volvos, my guy. It is the best it's car. Not a, I, that, that's a Volvo too, man. Yep. Look at this. We're in the fucking Volvo land. Yep. 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 When you cream her. Jesus. <laughs> she came over and she got creamed. Bruh, what would you do if your girlfriend got creamed by another guy? Is she know, uh, your, is she, <laughs> she know your girl no more? No, could you forgive she, her after she gets creamed? I mean... It, I wouldn't want to touch her. Oh my god. Do you hear the story about that guy? No. What story? Okay, there's this uh, girl which was on a podcast, right? Yeah. And she's confessing about like the nastiest things that she has done, right? Uh -huh. So she says, Well, I was with my boyfriend and he was kind of like tired. So my ex phoned me and I went over to him and he creamed me. And when I came home, he licked my, my boyfriend, licked my pussy, oh, and whoa. he said, I like the way your no, pussy no, tastes. No, 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 I was no. like, God. Whoa, that's kind of crazy. Yeah, bro. That's, a, that's like one of the craziest stories. And that's when I was like, okay, I can't ever trust a woman. No, because no. girls, bro, to be honest, sometimes they're nastier than guys. Yeah. I mean, guys are nasty too, bro. Don't get it fucked up. Oh, bro, it was almost open. It is open. It's good to have an elevator it is. in this penthouse. Bro, the camera is so close. Yeah, but it's, looks not, like I'm a, <laughs> it's not looks that close. Like, look, looks like I'm staring into somebody's eyes. <laughs> but the 8K I wanna, on this one. I want to create a vortex with my Aikido. And they're always like... Oh, look at this. Look, look at this, bro. Bro, that, that's, that's a cream pie over there. Well, this that could be a, a commercial right here. Bro, Are you a lonely at, dude at, walking that, through bro. the corridor by yourself? Look at that, bro. You got the right type of clothes. Here, let me. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. Mm. Look at that. Stabilized. Bro, Stabby. The, the quality of the... Let me zoom in on that chicken. Mmm, look at that sauce. Look you can that, see bro. the microplastics in it. Jesus, that's, uh, that's something which is fucked up, the microplastics. We should stop using plastic, we should. Yeah. This, is, this is not good. But this is what we're gonna eat today. Guys, I wanna talk quickly about something which I read this week. And this is something that is very shocking. You know that there's a lot of AI which is coming out right now. That is good. That's going to revolutionize. I, I would say the whole year is just going to be AI. You know, a lot of people are going to lose their jobs, but apparently AI is racist. Yeah, so if you didn't know, this is actually a pretty big problem when it comes to AI and something we need to make sure gets talked about and fixed. A recent study at John Hopkins University used an undisclosed popular AI to program a robot and then asked it a number of questions. The robot preferred men over women, white people over people of color, and so on and so forth. Now, it's not because any of this is true. It's because the AI's program is pulling from biased data sets. Another example is the story of Robert McDaniel, who, despite having no record of violence, was flagged by the Chicago Police Department's predictive policing AI tool, saying he was more than 99.9% .9 likely to be involved in a shooting than the rest of the Chicago population. Because of this, he was added to the CPD's heat list and was placed under overt surveillance. Since being added to the heat list, McDaniels has been shot twice. Another study from 2019 discovered a clinical algorithm that a lot of hospitals were using to decide which patients needed care, found black patients had to be a lot sicker than white patients to receive the same care. As AI becomes more prominent in our lives and we work towards becoming a more inclusive society, fixing this is most definitely a priority. So uh, 
I don't know about that, you know. They're, they're programming in some racist things. Who knows, maybe an AI robot might just beat me to death. <laughs> like one of those like AI police robots, just like, <laughs> you know. But I, I hope not, because everything is getting, I guess, recorded. But uh, yeah, so uh, without further ado, let's chow, let's eat. Your girl got creamed on camera. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. Oh, yeah. oh my god. You want that uh, rice rice? I give you rice. I'll give, give you rice. rice, rice. Hey, what what happened what happened to your to your arm? Uh, I was wha wanking too hard and it just broke one day. Nah, stop. <laughs> No, I was you just... work something about construction or something or like construction. Yeah, I work, I work construction. I give, you, I give you chicken a, good a price. Shot. Chicken good price. Bro, look at that shit, bro. Oh I give it to you. Good look, look, look at that. Can you do like a, a swirl? Bro, film this, bro. I'm a drip it. Oh my god, don't do it. Do oh my, you're such a nasty. <laughs> you're such a nasty guy. Ooh. Oh my God, oh, Jesus! <laughs> oh Lord! Oh, she you're eating came. so much. She came over, this and is she what got, she got creamed. Damn! All right, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video.